Hey guys, happy Thursday. Uh, tomorrow's Friday, which makes me happy. But I'm going to answer your questions and I'm going to try and do it um, in one take because I want to go to bed. It's 11 o'clock and uh, I need to get some sleep, which is why I've decided that I'm actually not going to do Vedum. I'm going to do kind of like V. Odom instead. I'm going to do vlog every other day in May. So I'll be posting videos on mon Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays. And maybe a Saturday or Sunday in there occasionally. But um, yeah, it's a lot of work. Like, I didn't realize how much work it is and how time consuming it can be. So I'm going to switch to that and see how that works out. Hopefully it works out for the best. Yay! So, question number one comes from Delta Phi or Delta Phi 79, and he wants to know if I've ever thought about visiting the USA or moving to another country. I have visited the USA. Um, I went to a thousand islands in New York when I was in kindergarten. We went to a castle, an unfinished castle or something there. I don't remember. It was a long time ago, but it was pretty awesome. And then uh, when I was 20... My ex-boyfriend went a trip to Daytona, <laughs> to Daytona Beach for spring break, so uh, we went there for a week, and that was really sweet, because it was middle of February, so it was really, really cold here, but really, really warm there. And uh, would I move to another country? I already have, kind of. I was actually... Okay. Both my parents are Canadian citizens. My father was in the military. I was born on Canadian soil, but I was born in Germany, so I moved to Canada from Germany, so I've already done that. Hopefully that answers your questions. Uh, Paradox Designs wants to know how you make the perfect baked potato. The way that I make them is I uh, scrub the potato, and then I stab it multiple times with a fork. And then I nuke it for between three and five minutes. And then I take it out and I slice the top. I put a paper towel over it and I punch down once because that like breaks the uh, the fibers at the top. And then I just squeeze the ends and in towards the middle so it puffs out at the top. And then I slather it with uh, butter. And sometimes I do the sour cream and bacon bits, but not very often. So that's how I make my perfect baked potato. Uh, one St. George one wants to know if I were a Spice Girl, which Spice Girl would I be? And please explain your answer for it is important. Uh, I don't even remember her name. I think she was Ginger Spice. But I'm not positive. Like, that's horrible because I, well, I don't know what's more horrible. The fact that I don't remember her name or the fact that I used to listen to them religiously. Like, it, it's kind of an equal scale, I think, that, you know, I don't know something that is, like, so pop culture, and yet, at the same time, I know something that is so pop culture. Uh, but yeah, I would be Ginger Spice or Jerry Hallowell, because she was the smartest one. She got out, like, before all of them. Like, she was like, I am jumping this ship, see you bitches later, I am gone. And, uh... When you're in a group like the Spice Girls, that's the smartest move to make. So that would be my answer. And hopefully that is up to your uh, expectations. Marcel St. Jean wants to know if I was born in North Bay. I just answered that. No, I was born in Germany. And I moved to Canada when I was two. And I don't remember much about Germany. And I know maybe six words. Yep. Uh... Cat Piss wants to know, what high school did I go to? I went to Whittafield. Um, and they were, like, really well known for their drama programs, but I was never into drama. I don't know. I didn't fit in in high school. But that's the high school I went to. Gogmore Go Away wants to know if I were stranded in the middle of the wilderness somewhere, do I think I would survive? Not a snowball's chance in hell. Um, I'm far too whiny and scared and uh, sensitive to be stranded in the wilderness anywhere, so let's hope that that never happens because I will not get out. 
Well, if it happens, I hope I have my camera so that at least I can vlog. And then when they come and find me, they'll find the camera. And then maybe I'll put, like, a secret video on the card with my YouTube username and sign-in so they can go in and upload it. I don't know. I'm getting tired. <laughs> oh, boy. Wizzy... Okay. <laughs> Wizzy Wig Nutty Joe 51, I think I got that right, um, <laughs> wants to know, would I rather be attacked by a tiger-sized hedgehog or a hedgehog-sized hedgehog tiger? I would go with the hedgehog-sized tiger mostly because um, I have kittens, or I had kittens, and uh, that doesn't seem quite as scary as a tiger-sized hedgehog, so... I would just love him and hug him and cuddle him and squeeze him because I love tuggers. So Stokey Power wants to know if I have any plans or ever had tried uh, to quit smoking. And the answer is no. I don't currently have any plans and I have never had any plans uh, in the past. And I'm sure I will in the future, like, you know, when I am uh, hopefully having a child. At some point, um, I won't be smoking while pregnant, so I'll definitely be quitting, quitting then, but uh, as for now, no. No immediate plans. Delta Phi 79 again wants to know um, if I believe in ghosts. And I don't know, I believe there's a possibility that they're there, I just haven't experienced any myself, so I can't really say for sure, for sure that... Uh, like, I've seen some weird stuff and felt weird things, but I can't say for sure that it was a ghost. But I do believe that they exist. So hopefully that answers that. Because I don't know how else to answer it. Eclectic Girl 13 wants to know, when is my birthday? My birthday is in August. Yep. Uh, middle of August. Yay. I'm a Leo. Rawr. Paradise Waster has a bunch of questions here. He wants to know how long I've been single. I don't know, a couple years. What is my least favorite vegetable? I don't know, mushrooms, I guess. I don't like mushrooms. That is not my stepmother in my videos. That is my real mother. My stepmother uh, probably won't appear in any of my videos, but uh, yeah. It's my real mommy in my videos. Would I marry a poor man or a rich man? Um, I don't really care how much money they have. That is not, uh, like a determining factor, I guess. What is your favorite season? Winter, spring, summer, or autumn? The end of spring, start of summer, just before the bugs come out, but it's still really nice and warm. That's my favorite season. Uh, what is Eric's zodiac sign? I think he's a Gemini or a Pisces. I don't know. I think it's Gemini. You'll have to ask him. Um, and Cat Crazy Lover wants to know what makes me like thunderstorms. I don't know. I've always been I've always been really uh interested with like not natural disasters, but crazy weather. Um, in high school, I actually wanted to be a storm chaser, and then, or no, I wanted to be an NHL player, and then in the off season, I would be a storm chaser. So, I don't know what it is about them that makes me like them. It's just so much energy, I guess. You can feel so much energy during a thunderstorm. Uh, the car guy 454 wants to know, what was my first car? My first car was my Kia. Uh, Kia Rio, and it's still my car today. The last question comes from J. Monty Jams, and this is a really good question that I actually want to ask you guys as well. Um, what do you do to break yourself out of a bad mood? For me, it depends on what caused the bad mood and what kind of bad mood it is, because sometimes I'll have a bad mood where I'm just... where I'm upset, like I'm sad and kind of depressed, not like really depressed but just down in the dumps or I'll have a bad mood where I just hate the world and want to bitch about everything so when I get into um, those moods where I don't 
like anything that's going on and I don't like anybody and I just want to be left alone, I basically just kind of hibernate or I vent to people. Um, and if I'm in like the crying, like, um, depressed mood, I'll let myself cry. Or I'll go on and I'll watch funny videos on YouTube or I'll listen to music. But uh, that's where I'm going to end it. So hope you guys enjoyed. I hope I answered all your questions. And leave a comment below uh, letting me know what you guys do to break yourselves out of a bad mood. And uh, yeah, I might use some of those suggestions the next time I'm in a bad mood. So leave them in the comments below. And... Uh, I will see you guys tomorrow when it's Friday. Have a good night. Bye.